Politicians' positions on Bitcoin will alter the fate of elections sooner than most think. Bitcoin is going to rapidly become a hot political talking point. Just like most people, most politicians are still trying to even understand what Bitcoin is. So opinions and positions on Bitcoin will be volatile and experimental at first. Politicians and their teams will begin researching what Bitcoin is, how it works, and most importantly, who supports Bitcoin and who doesn't support Bitcoin. Every person that I talk to outside of Bitcoin doesn't care much about it. They're all busy living their normal lives, working a 9 to 5, accumulating dollars, and then passively investing in whatever their financial advisor tells them to. Most people are busy, distracted, and see Bitcoin as this speculative investment or gamble they are skeptical of but truly know nothing about. On the other hand, people interested in Bitcoin are incredibly interested in Bitcoin. They're captivated. They can't stop talking or thinking about it. They have a significant chunk of their net worth in Bitcoin, and Bitcoin is very important to a small but exponentially growing segment of the global population. Bitcoin holders are this new, growing, and tolerant minority. Everyone else just doesn't care. Now, I'm not an expert on politics or elections, but this seems like a politician's dream population segment. Bitcoin is a topic I don't know much about. 99% of my voter base doesn't care and will support me no matter which side I pick. And 1% of the population will immediately vote for me if I embrace Bitcoin. Or maybe more critically, if I disprove of Bitcoin, 1% of the population will immediately not vote for me and I gain nothing. This is how I see Bitcoin evolving in the political landscape. It's getting exponentially more intertwined with the world and politicians have critical cohorts of people that they can quickly capture by just taking a positive stance on Bitcoin. And of course, this is just Bitcoin today. Bitcoin tomorrow at gold parity, where Bitcoin may be worth $700,000 per coin at a $15 trillion market cap, that may occur when 5% or 10% of the population has some exposure to Bitcoin. That's the entire election right there. As a politician, you must embrace Bitcoin or you will lose that cohort of people and you will lose the election. This makes sense too. Holding Bitcoin doesn't take anything away from the rest of society. In fact, buying and holding Bitcoin just makes all other Bitcoin holders wealthier. Actually, it may make the entire world wealthier as people learn that they no longer need to hoard houses. Instead, they can just hold Bitcoin. This could help real home prices marginally fall, which is good for everyone complaining about the cost of living, and the investor can now get a better return by just holding Bitcoin. Bitcoin is a very positive sum game that negatively affects almost nobody. Politicians will soon learn this one simple fact. Embrace Bitcoin or lose.